The media is not saying anything about it, David Bonson, but I think the market's paid attention. COVID cases have come down steadily for four weeks. The market has rocketed higher steadily for four weeks. There's got to be a correlation there. What do you see with respect to just what the market is telling you today, uh, particularly with this Abbott Labs news? Well, Charles, you're a complete exception to this because you've been telling the truth all summer. But the media's lies by omission have gone on for more than four weeks. It's gone on all summer of telling the story of cases growing in Florida, Arizona, Texas, but not telling the story of hospitalizations, not getting to the point they feared, of making ridiculous comparisons to the March-April tragedies that we saw here in New York City, and ultimately not telling the story of mortalities growing. That's what this is all about. We don't want people dying. The media has not told the truth there. As far as where the Fed is and and the overall economy, I'm with you completely. That rotation has had a lot of false alarms. That rotation's coming. Markets are mean reverting instruments. We are going to revert to the mean. And those names that have not had their day in the sun are going to get it. Uh, we've got less than 30 seconds, Bonson, but I do want to get your two picks in there. EPD and NMFC, they're intriguing to me because these are some pretty hefty yields. Yeah, they sure are. And I'm picking the high yielders here because I believe these dividends are so stable. We've gone to hell and back over the last five months. They've maintained the distribution. Enterprise Product is the best oil and gas pipeline company in the country. You can't have more bad news priced in than has already been priced in. New Mountain, lender to a lot of small companies, middle markets, a play on economic recovery, stable, big distributions in a permanently low interest rate environment. 